Hello, this is John from WHMCS. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to create a custom WHMCS template to match your existing website's design. We're already in the WHMCS directory. Now open the templates directory. WHMCS includes three templates, default, portal and classic. Here we will be basing our custom template on the default template. So begin by creating a duplicate of the default template and rename it. The new name should all be one word. Now open the newly created directory. Each file controls the appearance of a different page of the public and client areas. The two files that control the overall appearance of every page are header and footer, so we'll be concentrating on those. First open the header.tpl file, then open the source of your website template. The aim of the exercise is to copy the various parts of your website template into the appropriate place in the WHMCS template files, starting with the CSS and JavaScript tags in the head tag. Paste these above the closing head tag in header.tpl. Switch back to your website template and copy everything from below the body tag down to the point at which page content starts. Then paste it into header.tpl replacing the entire WHMCS header div. This particular template contains inline JavaScript, so it's necessary to wrap it with literal tags, as shown here. Now we just need to adjust the paths of the CSS files and images. So using the existing CSS lines as an example, adjust the CSS and image paths as shown here. That's all for this file, so save it. Now we move on to the footer.tpl file, so open that. From your website template, copy the code from the point at which the page content ends down to the closing body tag, not inclusive. Then paste it into footer.tpl as shown here. That's all the template modifications done, so save the file. Open your FTP client and connect. Navigate to the WHMCS templates directory and upload the newly created directory. Now locate your website template and upload the other elements from the template, the CSS and images. You can privately preview the template before putting it live by adding the sys template variable to the URL as shown here. Once you've made any final tweaks and everything is in order, you can put it live by selecting the newly created template on the setup general settings page. Congratulations, you've finished your custom template. Thanks for watching.